Show jumping as a whole is a demanding sport. There's hundreds of good riders. The few that come to the top at the end of the day are the ones that really push themselves to the limits. If ever I was going to fail, it was only down to my own mistakes. The Olympics has been a dream of mine since I was very young. To win a gold medal at a home Olympics on a homebred horse is something that I'll never forget. The level of dedication needed for show jumping or any sport at such a high level is huge. We always look at the science behind the horse, the feeding, the fitness, resting the horse. They live a five-star lifestyle, our horses. They get everything they need to be able to perform to the highest levels. Every horse on the stable is given every bit of care and treatment to make it feel its best to then obviously get the best result when we're at a show. The partnership between horse and rider is vital. I mean, you've got, to, you've, got, you've got to love your horse, first of all, and he's got to love you, and you've got to be able to work with each other every day. Show jumping is a technical sport. The approach to the fence is the most important part of show jumping. It's how you take the corner, the impulsion you have through the turn, the angle maybe of which you approach your fence, and the momentum you take to get you over that jump. The demands that we as course designers put for the horse and riders have to be solvable by the riders. So the difficulties that we put in are the distances between fences so that the rider has to adjust the horse's stride between them. I have to trust my horse. Uh, the horse has to trust me. They're big jumps, meter 60. The width of the jumps is what people don't understand. It's very wide, it's very demanding on their body physically. They've got to want to fight for their rider and win as much as their rider wants to win. Creating a bond between horse and rider is key. Triple X has a star quality. He believes in himself. He has a very personal presence about him, and I think he genuinely believes he's good. I think Ben Mayer is absolutely world-class rider. He's probably the best we have in the UK. Um, he's so professional. When I ride under pressure, uh, I think that's when the, the best of me comes out. I find that the majority of our really good top riders excel under pressure. Of course there is pressure. To compete for your country it was a privilege. You give everything to the, the moment. I want to win. I want to be the best at what I do, obviously, but not at the detriment to my horses. The more spirit they have, the more they'll fight for you when the chips are down. There's always room for improvement. I don't think anyone's ridden the perfect test yet in dressage.